Brendan. When I first met you, I didn't know the everlasting impact you would have on my life. You are the most caring, kind, and selfless person I know, and I will forever consider myself lucky to call you mine. I prayed for someone who would love me unconditionally, and when I got to know you, I knew my prayers were answered. I thank God every day for bringing you into my life. You make me a better person, and you complete me. You are my best friend and my better half. With you, I know I will never have to do anything alone. We've made so many memories together, but this one might be my favorite. So now on the seventh day of the seventh month of our seventh year together, I get to marry you. My promise to you is to always be honest, kind, and supportive. I promise to be patient and loving through it all, to cherish you as my husband and the love we have today, tomorrow, and forever. Today we say I do, but to me, we say I will. I will stand by your side no matter what for the rest of our lives. Elizabeth. I remember the first week we met in Florida and telling my roommate, man, I really like this girl, but she lives in Pennsylvania. There is something about you that I wanted to know more of. I had no idea at the time that you were about to change my life for the absolute best. I remember the first time I told you that I loved you. I never felt that way before, and I knew I never wanted to let that love for you go. From that point on, my love grows for you every day. I vow to never let my love go for you and to be by your side in life no matter what. I promise to always do my best to make you happy because that is what you deserve. I thank God every day for bringing you into my life. You gave, you gave me a purpose during a time when I had no idea where my life was going. You are the best thing that has ever happened to me and I don't know where I would be without you. I'll never stop loving you.